In the meantime, Delta State Governor Fanyi Okoa says his administration has accessed 30 billion out of the 150 billion naira that it applied from a financial institution under the bridging finance loan. The state governor and vice presidential candidate of the People's Democratic Party made this known while fielding questions from journalists shortly after inspecting some projects in Asaba, the state capital. Our correspondent in Asaba, Okbome Jero Friday, reports that Governor Okowa said 25 billion naira out of the 30 billion naira bridging finance already accessed by the state government has been deployed into some projects, while the remaining 5 billion naira was channeled into the payment of pensioners in the Bureau for State Pensions and the Local Government Pensions Bureau. Dr. Okowa also pointed out that local government pensioners were not under the state's purview adding that the money was given to them as grant from the state government. So, uh, unfortunately, as of today, from the last report that I got, we have only been able to assess 30 billion of it, and we have deployed it into various projects. We also have uh, directed, and I think that has been done too, to, for them to give 2.5 million of that 30 million to the State Pension Bureau, and, and 2.5 billion to the State Pension Bureau to help offset some of the uh, actual services that were old workers. And we have also given a grant of 2.5 billion to the Local Government Pension Bureau. Local governments are not under us, but it's an assistance in grants to the Local Government Pension Bureau to help soften the monies that they are owing the uh, Local Government Pensioners in terms of actual services. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.